Hi, I'm Mark Klein, Director of Operations for Kirtos Technologies. I'd like to take a few moments to show you how Kirtos is revolutionizing the process of moving knowledge from books to bytes. It all starts with the APT book scan system, which is vastly different from any other method of scanning bound documents. First off, while most other processes involve disbinding the book, with the Kirtos equipment, there's no reason to destroy the book. We can scan the book 10 to 20 times faster than any manual page turning process. Kirtos's patented sure turn robotic page turning arm and smart cradle allow the content of bound documents from 4.5 by 7 to 11 by 14 inches to be digitized without disbinding. And the Kirtos process is actually more gentle than a human hand or any available sheet feeder. Speed is certainly not a limiting factor with the APT book scanner. There are two basic configurations. The APT book scan 1200 is equipped with one 16.1 megapixel digital camera and captures pages using a mirror assembly. As the name implies, it can operate at a rate of up to 1200 pages per hour. The APT book scan 2400 is equipped with two digital cameras and captures both the right and left pages simultaneously doubling the rate of page capture. Although the technology seems pretty complicated, the whole process is relatively simple. With just a few clicks of the mouse and pushing a couple buttons, the APT begins snapping off images and turning pages. While the raw images begin to collect on the server, the APT manager which is the software that runs the machine, allows you to monitor the capture process and quality on the fly. Speaking of quality, let's take a closer look at what makes the Kirtos digitization process and its images superior to any other. First off, Kirtos doesn't use scanner technology to capture page images. To capture page content at 300 to 400 pixels per inch, we use a professional quality, high resolution, 16.1 megapixel digital camera. It easily attaches to the APT, which means when a higher quality camera becomes available on the market, the APT can easily be upgraded. The pages are captured in raw image format and full color, which means that you're starting with the highest quality possible. Once the pages are captured, we use the BookScan Editor software to rotate, crop, and skew the images as needed and remove the page clamps. This might sound like a tedious process, but the BSC allows you to set up templates for both the left and right pages and then batch process the entire book. You can also enhance the page quality by removing the background and dust and specs while leaving the grayscale and color illustrations or photos alone through a segmentation process. And once the book's content has been processed, it can be converted to PDF and printed on demand by Kirtos strategic partner, Colorcentric. Or the page images can be OCR'd using BSE Pro with Abbey Fine Reader to allow for online text-based searching. There's one aspect to the digitization process that I haven't mentioned yet, and that's how Kirtos leverages metadata. Kirtos has integrated barcode scanning technology into its process which allows for meticulous inventory control. We'll talk more about that later. But for right now, let's take a look at the digitization process in action. The Kirtos Service Bureau operates three shifts 24-7 and cranks out on average 15,000 plus books each month. You can't handle that kind of volume without having a comprehensive production plan in place. Let's take a closer look. It all starts here at the loading dock, where pallets of books are offloaded and entered into our inventory database. All right, this is uh, inventory. We received the books from the publishers. Uh, we've handled 125 different publishers. And what the ladies are doing right now are sorting. They do it by size. That way, uh, we can minimize the setup time on the scanners. After that, they'll put them into projects. They wand each of the books so that we take the barcode and use that. It goes throughout the whole entire system. And then when we're done, 
the books come back in here after they're up on the FTP. Once the books are through the entire process, um, we palletize them and await information from the client for disposition of the books. Once the books are logged into the system, they're transported to the digitization room where imaging technicians actually begin moving the content from books to bytes. I select my book from the project uh, that's been given to us from the warehouse. I scan the barcode which pulls up all the metadata from the book and I scan the entire book front to back. From there the book gets flagged and sent to the processing department. I scan about 20 to 24 books a day, 8,000 to 9,000 pages approximately. Um, after the books are scanned, uh, at that point we go through the KILTS database and uh, we use a program called Book Scan Editor to retrieve those books. Uh, and from that point we'll template the books which will uh, basically set the parameters that we're going to use for the rest of the process for that book. Uh, once the template's been created, it'll move on to the process called QC. Uh, and in QC, basically, we refine those images. We do any uh, extra work that needs to be done, cropping, uh, adjustments to the brightness and the contrast of the images. Uh, and after the book is finished with the QC process, it'll move on to the process called QA. And QA is basically the final step in the process uh, for us down here. QA is uh, an overlook of the entire book and all of its images to assure that all of the pages are there, all of the images meet Kirtas standards, and the book is ready to be moved on to OCR after that point. Uh, on average, uh, your average processor can template approximately 100 books per day. Uh, they can QC approximately 30 books per day, and they can QA anywhere from 120 to 130 books per day. So there you have it. This book might have been out of circulations collecting dust on a shelf in some warehouse for years. It wasn't generating income for the author or the publisher and wasn't accessible to the public, at least not until today. Now it's ready to be read online or to be read as an ebook or even printed on demand. This book and thousands like it will have the potential to be accessed by readers worldwide. Because at Kirtas, we really are moving knowledge from books to bytes.